about seven o'clock, I've, um, I've come to Farley on a short family break. I thought I'd try and grab a couple of hours to myself to try and get a sunrise. So I've come to Farley Country Park. In particular, I've come to Farley Brig. I've got beautiful clear skies above me. And I've got horrendous grey skies and cloud on the horizon. There's a little bit of colour showing already. Um, I'll just see if I can turn you around and I'll see if I can show you what, I've, what I can see. So there is a possibility of a reasonable sunrise. Let's take a walk, see what we can get. arrived at the end of Farley Brig and I've got to say it's absolutely stunning I've got great views all the way around me I mean just look at that as you can see there's quite a bit of cloud on the horizon so I'm not going to get the sun as it comes up but hopefully as it breaks above that cloud it'll cast some great light on the landscape and on the sea and maybe try and get a few reflections I'll just kind of show you what's behind me so this side we've got Flamborough Head I don't know if you can quite see the lighthouse on Flamborough it's just lighting up in the background and I've got sea and Scarborough to the other side so I'm just going to set up and I'm going to work out a composition and let's see what we're going to take right I'm all set up now so I'll just talk you through it my camera is set at f11, I've gone manual focus, I've gone for around about a third of the way in. I'm getting a shutter speed of roughly around about one second at the minute. I've got a three stop hard grad filter, it's just lowering the uh, sky down, it's balancing the scene. I'm just going to wait for a little bit of sun and hopefully we'll get some great images. Right, I'll just take you through the composition. I've got a little building at the bottom of the brig, which is just giving the image a little bit of scale. And what I've got is the brig sweeping out to the, to the right of the image as a leading line to hopefully where the sun will rise. What I've got is the uh, two second timer on the shutter, so every time I press it it'll wait two seconds for the camera to steady. It's not on the most stable part of the, uh, the brig, so it just, it just moves just slightly. So with the two second timer it just allows it to stabilise and I get a still image. If you're wondering why I keep pressing the shutter, it's because the light is constantly changing and I don't want to miss the best of the light. So when I come to somewhere like this, I may take 30, 40 images of the same scene but each one, the light is gradually getting better until it starts to get worse. That way I know I've got the best of the light. It's now 20 to eight. It doesn't look like the sun is gonna come through those clouds, so I'm not gonna get the light that I wanted. I've got to say, it's still nice to come out to somewhere like this though and uh, enjoy the surroundings. I've seen the birds flying over and it's just absolutely beautiful. I mean, I would like to go down onto the brig 
but I've not checked the tide times, so I don't know if the tide's coming in or it's coming out. So for safety reasons, on this occasion, I think I'm gonna have to leave it. But I can also mark it like a mental note for next time, just to check it out. And then maybe I can go down and get some slow exposures next time. We've actually started to get some light. I don't know if you can quite see it, it's just reflected on the sea now. Just at the end of Filey Brig. The sun is just shining through that little bit, that little gap in the cloud. Great stuff. The sun's just coming above into that gap. Perfectly placed gap gap is. The sun is coming through nice and strong now. It's giving some great light. I'm really glad I've got these filters on. They really are helping to just to bring back that sun a little bit. And just catch some of that detail in the foreground. And get some nice reflections on this roof of this little building. It's just fantastic. The sun's just behind those clouds at the minute, but it's giving lovely rays.